seven people have been detained in Alabama after blocking the entrance to a detention center for undocumented immigrants. The protesters each also <clears throat> undocumented themselves, chained themselves in front of the Atoa County Detention Center. An activist with the Alabama Coalition for Immigrant Justice said the rally was called to oppose harsh conditions for prisoners. So asking that uh, the Etowah Detention Center treat their um, detainees better. A lot of them have been complaining that they're not getting the appropriate food, uh, that they're not allowed to practice all of their religion, they're being abused, and three, that they uh, don't have an area in which they can actually go outside and breathe fresh air. The Alabama protest comes as dozens of prisoners at the immigration jail in Washington state have resumed a hunger strike. The strikers began refusing meals earlier this month in a call for improved conditions at the Northwest Detention Center in Tacoma, owned by the GEO Group. An attorney for the prisoners says around 70 have assumed fasting, have resumed fasting, after the jail's managers failed to implement pledge reforms. The nonpartisan Congressional Budget Office, meanwhile, has released figures estimating an immigration reform bill advanced by House Democrats would decrease the federal deficit by $900 billion over 20 years. The House measure is similar to the bill passed by the Senate immigration reform has stalled in the House, where Republicans have refused to allow a vote.